Good evening to our party activists, members, supporters, donors, etc. We are here outside of Stropra Methodist Church where a, a local hustings has just uh, taken place and about to finish. Um, we're here partly because we are uh, doing a silent um, and peaceful protest about the fake democracy versus real democracy in that uh, our candidate, Frank Calladine, wasn't allowed to personally represent himself or the party at the hustings. Um, and with that, I'll hand you over to uh, Dr. Jim Luthwaite, our, uh, our chairman. And uh, uh, Jim, if you'd like to say a few words, please. Yes, we're here to make a peaceful protest about the fact that four parties were not allowed to represent themselves at the hustings. It's not a question of uh, bias against left or right. It's a bias against freedom of speech and freedom of representation. The parties excluded ranged from the far left to ourselves, so-called far right, we would call ourselves nationalists because the term far right is actually meaningless. But the parties excluded were the Yorkshire Party, the Party of Women, the Trade Union Socialist uh, TUS, TUSC, and ourselves. Now, there's nothing in common between the four of us except we're not part of the inner circle of the establishment. It's quite clear that in the uh, final selection it was Labour, Conservative and Green and two parties either stood down or could not attend, the Lib Dems and the Social Democrats who are in league with the Reform Party. Essentially people are being subjected to propaganda which they can get from the newspapers or the TV the whole time. What they might be interested in is new and original views from parties that have only just started up and that is what they are not going to get. W one of our activists has just raised that point and was immediately silenced by the chairman merely for asking the question what is the, what is the difference between true and fake democracy? He was told that was an inappropriate question. Well, I think to members of my party, but also to the wider general public, it's a very significant question. This looks like very much a stitch up between the existing parties to exclude anybody who might uh, question the whole approach of the political class to the politics of this country and the exclusion of parties which offer new and original views, whether they are of the left, the right, or as in the party of women, uh, neutral. Thank you very much. And finally, on that point, um, the activist that asked the question, um, he was asked to stop, and when he didn't stop, the microphone was turned off automatically. Thank you, Miss, uh, thank you, Jim, for your for your input there, and uh, um, hopefully onwards and upwards for the party. Many thanks. Thank you, Keith.